Hello everyone, well if Paris Saint-Germain don't go through to the quarter-finals tonight this is a match we'll be talking about for quite some time and what an atmosphere inside the new peace and quiet as now they come out into the arena well Barcelona have previously lost the first leg away from home in Europe 26 times Don't defend properly, they can certainly lose it during that period. But they're safe anywhere near as well tonight. PSG will advance. Encounter between Saint Etienne and Manchester United in France, in which United won one nil. Looking uh, quite relaxed at the start, saying he's convinced his team will be close to qualifying. And we're underway here. This is the third knockout contest between the clubs in five seasons. Rafinha, first touch for him. A little dink in and. Kevin Trapp thought about coming for it, thought better of it, has it gone over the line? Is there an early goal for Barcelona? Here there is, and they've scored! Oh, what a sensational start to the match! Barcelona score with two minutes on the watch! Well, you sense the crowd can feel it, the players can feel it. PSG have dropped back very early in the game. Header away by Thiago Silva. The shot danger now as uh, Julian Draxler has his first touch of the ball in the whole match and he's claiming a handball there off uh, Mascherano well there's more of a case for this one than there was at the other end because Mascherano it's Messi for Barcelona and Trapp watches it go over the top well there's a massive stuff but far more of it via their number 11 Neymar who sends that one over the top of Trapp and wide of the post well he's going to get a lot of the ball out on that left-hand side, got that creativity. Messi looks for that creativity now, it was Matt inside the penalty area, here's Iniesta. Poor ball, Iniesta couldn't get there, Lucas was a stoppy, it was poor, and can Barcelona make them pay for it? Suarez, easy save. Iniesta lets it run, then tries to chase down on Marquinhos, so oh, he's done well, Iniesta! Oh, and it's a second goal! And it really is game on here! Calamitous defending from Paris Saint-Germain! And Barcelona, for the second time in the first half, force the ball over the line! 2-0 on the night, 4-2 on aggregate! And Way as far as some TT, and there goes the half-time whistle. Well, Luis Enrique said he was convinced his team would make a game of this tie. Welcome back, the home fans growing a little impatient, waiting for the arrival of the Paris players for the second half here. Here now is Draxler. Early threat here from PSG. And has Trapp, has uh, Ter Stegen stopped that one from going behind. Away off the boot of Busquets. Goal kick. Knees do better Neymar than that. on the near side. Oh, lovely little flair, down he goes, and no, the referee's not going to give a penalty there, and Barcelona can't believe it. Well, I think he has to give a penalty here, We're just having words now with the assistant behind. What a big moment. So, uh, it's Messi for Barcelona, 3-0. Stunning start to the second half. And it's unravelling for Paris Saint-Germain. They're in big trouble, leaning back on the ropes now. And Barcelona, one goal away from forcing extra time. Well, he chose the right way. Trap. Good play by Murnier. He's away from the... Oh, it's off the post there. And Cavani almost with what would have been a vital away goal. First real glimpse of goal that Cavani has had. And he nearly made it count. Murnier... Real threat, Cavani! That's the goal that PSG were so desperately hoping for. And suddenly, they're feeling a whole lot better about themselves. And four and a half thousand Parisian supporters leap about for joy. Into Cavani, Cavani's away from Mascherano. Oh, what a vital save there by Ter Stegen. Much better play from PSG now. 
Cavani has to play on that last line. He makes such good runs in this tie. But here they come, and it's hard to turn around, and it's clear. Neymar with an untimely shot. Trying to win a free kick, might pay for it too. Messi still going. Right across the face of the goal. They can't afford to give the ball away in those sort of areas. Side. And it comes, PK's up there, and as the ball comes back in, just onto the roof of the net, the flag has gone up over on the far side. PK, I think the player the offside. And as soon as he challenged the goalkeeper, the assistance flag went up on that far side. It's Thiago Silva who uh, I think has gone behind Mash Tirano. Here comes Angel Di Maria. He's got some support. You'd imagine Neymar would look to hit the far post here. Try and bend it into that far corner. Have a couple of the Barca pl the loner players racing across the goalkeeper's line. Now, what's Neymar got up his sleeve here? Oh, he's got something really special up his sleeve. Great goal. Neymar for Barcelona. 4-1 on the night. 4-5 on aggregate what a free Messi. kick Messi Neymar makes the run it's forward towards Suarez and he goes inside the penalty area it is a penalty kick I think for Barcelona Neymar against Trap. he scored two quick goals for Neymar right at the end of the game it's 5-1 Barcelona Five, five on aggregate. And it's now all about how much any time is going to be given here. And the fans uh, got their heads right back into this game now. And TT sent it into the box. It was big, big moments coming here. It's going to be a cross into the box. And it comes from Lionel Messi. And for once, it's not a great delivery. Right back side here. They've got to make sure they stay on side. These Barcelona players. Oh, what a grandstand finish to this game. Away off the uh, head of Adrian Rabio. Intense pressure now on the Paris Saint-Germain defence. It's Neymar trying to feed it through. It's a stretch and it's in. And I can't remember the last time I saw something like this. Extraordinary scenes at the new Camp. Sergio Roberto, the substitute, is the hero of the hour. And it is the greatest Champions League knockout comeback of all time. What a pass from Neymar. I thought he'd made the wrong decision by coming back onto his left foot. PSG started to squeeze up. Just... Little look at the watch from the referee. Oh, it was almost the last kick of the game. Well, there have been many famous nights in Barcelona's history, but this one is right up there. 6-1 on the night. 6-5 on aggregate, drama from the first kick of the game to the last and Paris Saint-Germain are shell-shocked they cannot believe that a 4-0 lead has evaporated